We want to change the water pump impeller on our Onan L423 engine, which is running a 20 kilowatt generator, our old generator, and uh, needs a new impeller and the bearings I think are going out. So we're going to change the impeller and bearings on that little water pump. It's a Sherwood K75B. We're rebuilding a raw water pump for our generator on the boat. I gotta get these old nasty bearings off. The shaft had a bunch of damage on the end of it, so we tried to clean that up, otherwise we're not gonna pull it past. So hopefully we've got enough off there to get this thing off now. We used a caliper to check the measurement here. Seems like there's still a little bump right there. So, all right, so we're gonna hit that one spot, right? Right there again. Okay, just setting up our bearing puller. All right. Need a little bit more reach for the bottom one. Another blue 20. Yeah, just give it a little cushion for the pushing. Where are we caught guy? We couldn't video that. I had to have some backup. That one was tight. The shaft doesn't look any worse for wear though, so we'll clean it up. So what do you do to hold it? <laughs> you held it. So we have this thing to hold it. I don't like that. <laughs> what long? A long extension and a deep socket. Just so because. Stop spinning around. It fit on the arms of the puller. What number is that? I don't know. Whatever fits. How about a 15, 16? I just didn't want your fingers in there, honey. No. Well, we finally got it all back together. It looks nice. Got some new stainless hardware in there. Got our new impeller and everything. And um, well, now we're gonna put it on and try it. We didn't film the part where we pressed the bearings on and off because that was such a pain in the butt and we needed, I needed cinnamon to help me actually hold that. But that was the worst part was um, putting the bearings on and off. We did put the bearings out in the sun, it was about 100 degrees, and we put the, um, the shaft in the freezer next to the ice. And uh, that made it, um, putting it on a lot, a lot easier. So now we just, I'm um, gonna put it on and see if she pumps water and doesn't leak and, or burn up. So we'll see how we did. Okay, it's all put back together and um, we're ready to try it. So uh, now comes a big test. This would be a little bit noisy. I'm going to run up top right away and see if it's pumping water. 